few years ago. I was in Toronto, downtown Toronto, and I, we received a call. My team received a call from the Muslim community in Toronto. And they said to us, there's 5,000 uh, Muslim in our, in our um, organization that are members of the Conservative Party of Canada. We had questions for you as a candidate, and we had every candidate that came to visit us, and we asked, we are asking the same questions to every candidate. And you, Mr. Bernie, you didn't come to visit us, and the election of your party will be in three weeks from now. If you want to maybe have 5,000 votes, it would be good for you to come and visit us. And I said, okay. I went downtown in Toronto, and I did the kind of an interview, and they asked me the same question that was very fair, the same questions to everybody. And at the end, <clears throat> that was a lady, and she asked me the last question. And she said, Mr. Bernie, if you don't know the answer right now, you can think about it. You can go back to Ottawa and write the answer. Because, you know, <laughs> it's the most important question. After an interview of 35 minutes, she said, that's the most important question because we're going to put on our website all the questions and all the answers from every candidate. And our people will judge the candidates by that last question, the way you answer that last question. So take your time. Sir. What is the question? <laughs> she said, what you will do, what you will do for the Muslim community. I said, that's the question? I said, no. I look at her, I said, nothing. <laughs> I, said, I said, I won't do, I won't do anything for the Muslim community. I won't do anything for the Jewish community. I won't do anything for the Christians community. You are Canadians, and I will do everything for you as a Canadian. <laughs> so,